Hello everybody, so I'm going to compare my two products. I just opened the parcel here. So this was inside like this um, and that. So I got these two products, they came like this. So I'm gonna put it back and I'm gonna try, it's the Emma Holberg and the Emma Lizzy and I'm so excited because I'm really a fan of highlighters and I can't really find my highlighter all the time. Um, yeah. And then I got a sample of Bare Minerals and I'm already using these two products from Bare Minerals. The photo primer and the Smashbox water primer here. I've also been using the um, MAC Prep, Prep Prime and the um, Urban Decay Prime here. So I'm kind of talking very slowly. I wish I had the microphone on now because people are asleep. This is the M Resi one. It looks so fancy. Like, oh my god. It actually, oh my god, it looks like I don't know how to explain this, but it looks like like a sheet. Like, it just looks so wonderful. I don't know how to explain. So this is the Anastasia highlighter. It was out of stock for about a year everywhere. It was like a limited edition in Sweden. Um, now I'm opening the Emma Halber one, which is from Makeup Store. So she's been working with the Makeup Store brand. Let me just see here, and this one looks like this. It's more yellowish, and this one, can you see the difference between the two? This one is more yellowish. Yeah, I'm kind of like a warm tone girl, so I have some MAC blush on. I'm gonna try this now. I have this big hair that I tied up, but I'm wondering how this looks like. I just hope I don't look like a Christmas tree. And this is something that I want to use the whole year. So the pigment, I mean, this one looks really nice on my tone. Seriously, I don't know if I'm using the correct brush. Let me try with this type of brush. Or maybe I'll be, I'll be, maybe I need to wet the brush or something. Let me just try here. Yeah, this looks, it has a really nice color. But I can't see a lot right now. But it's nice. Yeah, that's a really nice highlight. I wanted the Fenty one, but I went to um, Sephora and they recommended me other brands. I don't know why. So this is, I'm oh, sorry, this is the makeup store. Oh, she doesn't have a packaging. It's just the Emma Holger. Let us see the Emma Z. Oh my god, both are like really nice. Let me just put this parcel here. This is like, I don't even know which one to use. Can I just put it with my finger maybe and see the difference? I think I need to use this while I don't have any, um, let me see. So this is the Emma Halber one and this is the Emma Z one. I'll see if I put some on the nose. It looks really good. I don't know really, like both look really good. So this is the Emre Z side. Emre Z, or do you say Emre Z? And this is the Emma Holber side. I really don't know which one to use. Let me just see here. I don't know really, it's just like I don't know, maybe I should wet the brush and see. Maybe 
see if I lift the brush. I get more results. This is a big brush, but I'll try it. This. Let me see now. This one gives that dewy, dewy look. I don't know if this is an everyday look, but I really like the Emma Halbe one as well. But then again, I just feel like this one, I don't know, let me see. I don't want to mix up the two. But this one is on the nose as well, so it would, it looked really good on the nose. This, I don't know, I just, maybe the lightening is too much, but the Amrozy one is really metallic, really like, it makes you look really professional. Then maybe I need to get the Emma Halby one on the nose as well and see how that will be. Let me just see if I can remove some of this. this is a really hard thing like I, I really don't know I, need, I will need to make another video okay the Emma Halbe one I wouldn't put on my nose it kind of like the Emma Halbe one it accentuates your traits and I already have quite a large nose so I would put the Emrezy on the nose and but she has a more like warmer tone to it put on the to put the Emrezy over here although if I put the Emrezy over here let's see more And then the Emma Hobby. This is so difficult. Like, I wasn't prepared for this at all. So, this is how it looks here. I think the Amrezy is stronger. Do you see the difference? This one looks, melts kind of like. I think the I don't know really I just I'm just happy I bought both because this is really hard to decide which one to use if I used okay let's say I use Emma Halbe on both sides now let's just see if I can get off this that's a good way to remove it so if I use the Emma Halbe one it becomes like this It gives that youthful look, the Emma Halber highlight. Whilst I think the Amrezy gives that Instagram, not really, like both gives Instagram look, but this one is shinier and this one is more for glowing. Let me see if I use the Amrezy. And the Amrezy has like, I think it's more suitable for all different type of tones. It's more neutral. It gives more of a, um, the Amrezy gives more of a photoshopped finish, I would, I would say. A more smoother look. As you can see. So it's Emma Halberg versus Emrezy. 
and right now to my taste it's kind of hard to say really I think I need to try this in daylight and different lightning because I just feel like it's just too light over here but yeah um, um, I think it depends on the type of look you're going for but I love both of them thumbs up for both of these and I will have to do another video where I try them out individually again and compare but right now I just feel like the Emma Halbert has a nice tone to it a more yellowish tone and it brings out the futures but I, I still feel like the Emma Z is more for like an evening romantic look okay so i will have to leave you guys now thank you so much bye